Hello and welcome to Infinity. Here's a photo I took recently. Um, it's being shown just in, in Windows File Explorer. And you can see here I've got the tips of these towers quite close to the edge. And I've got the tip of this boat. I've got it just in to keep those in. If I right click this now and click open, this is now going to open in Affinity Photo. But look at what's happened here. The tip of that is gone. And the tip of this is gone. So what's happened? I actually thought this was a bug and reported it to Affinity and they very kindly pointed out that it's not a bug, it's a feature. And they're right. And uh, here, if we go to the Assistant Manager and go to here, it says Lens Corrections, Apply Lens Corrections. So it's automatically applied a lens correction. You can turn that off if you want to. But you find this here. You've got the Basic tab, but then there's the Lens tab and this thing here, Lens Correction. You can turn that on or off and you can see what's happening. So if I turn that off, there we go, it's still there, but the pictures, this has got some curves in it. It's very carefully, neatly fixed that. So I, I put that on and this is stretched a bit. And, but I've lost these other areas here, even this bit of this one and so on. So I could, turn this, keep the lens correction on here and turn it off just here because it's just for that lens and then play with this myself and then you're going to get these areas at the edge here which you can have to in paint so I could do that but if I want to keep the, the correction they've made which is the specific one for that lens um, what I can do is turn it back on again but now I go to the crop tool I just stretch the canvas a bit like that, which it'll do. Stretch the canvas there, then click on another tool here. And you can see it's appeared here. So it's actually stretched, it hasn't lost the bit. So I now click on develop. And I can now go to the photo persona. And what I've got in here is the picture here, but with the edges in and I'm just going to fix that by going to select alpha range select partially transparent and then do edit and in paint and it'll do it best to fix those areas and I've done that control D now I've got those towers in it's had to go things let's check up here if it's done it okay uh, that's not so good on that bit. The sky is all right, but all I need to do is go to the clone brush tool, pick an area down here, say, and copy that in up there. And then do the same sort of with this and copy that in and fix this here as well. And so on. do this sort of thing all the way around. Check if there's anything you need to fix, but it's easy enough. But I've now recovered this. I got the tip of my boat and I'm happy. So there you go. Thank you very much for watching.